Shmeen here was Stillwater Senior Living, and we have a group of residents that have decided to share with you their stories on why they chose Stillwater and the importance of coming to a community that is locally owned and operated. Um, Dwayne, tell me about one of your first stories or encounters with Kathy, the owner of Stillwater. Uh, we came in, the first person that Shirley and I talked to was Kathy, and she showed us around a place, and I asked her if she, if the place included a chapel, and she said, no, but we will have a service Sunday morning at whatever you want. I said, well, uh, that sounds good. She said, you and Shirley come to this table Sunday morning and there'll be a service here. So Shirley and I showed up. We were the only two besides Kathy. She was at the end of the table. She had a Bible in front of her and we had a nice little service right in there, the three of us. We had prayer when it was over and we went our ways and that impresses me. Kathy is amazing and very, very spiritual. And there's um, a lot of instances that can be stressful in this type of industry. And many of our meetings, she'll start off with prayer. And it's very, very impressive to have that um, led by the owner of a, of a company. So mm -hmm. um, one, one of the reasons why I thoroughly enjoy being here. Yeah. Um, Faye, you had spoken that before you joined them, um, that you were in the hospital, and if you want to tell us that story about being okay. with your diagnosis. Okay. I very quickly came on with dementia, and I was living alone at my house, and I could not. Uh, I went out one day and started the car, or was supposed to start the car, I couldn't figure out which button to, start, to do. So I called my daughter, and from there it led it from doctor to uh, Barnes Hospital. And I went to Barnes, and I stayed three weeks. And then they uh, took me to Meridian for rehab. When I got ready to leave rehab, they didn't have any place for me. And my daughter lives just up the street, and she knew they were building this. So she came down, and then she found out it was Kathy, and I knew Kathy. And it was a, uh, it, it just fit perfectly. And I had nothing to do with bringing me here. They, they brought me here, my furniture was here, and I've been here ever since. <laughs> and your experience in regard to your diagnosis with dementia? Well, I, I, they helped me here because I had hallucinations when I come here. Mm -hmm. And I could see people out in the courtyard and all kinds of stuff. But anyway, they helped me. Um, the, the girl that was here then, her name was Tracy. And she was in the evening, on the nights. And she'd sit there and talk to me and talk to me and get me straightened out. Because I would cry. I didn't know where I was. And it was, it was frightening. But it all worked out. And I, I think that uh, I, I decided I wanted to stay here so they sold my house. And I'm here. And I stay until something happens to me, I guess. Well, the, the, the old adage, if you don't use it, you lose it. Right. And now you're using it every day. Right. I see you down in the dining room, see you in activities. Yeah. And that, that's the kind of success stories we want to hear. Yes. Um, Pat, you were talking about your um, very first day here which we don't really want to relive, but go ahead and tell us that story. Well, I, my kids found this place, but they wanted me to, they traveled, and I wanted to go to a place that I would enjoy. So they, they interviewed like nine different places. And when they found this place, I was at where she said, mm -hmm. they came and they said, Come on. And I said, I just got to, I need to take a shot. No, 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 come on now. So I came and I've been here. But my first day, 
I walk with Frank, and I'm feeling real good. I got to the entrance to the dining room and fell flat on my face. <laughs> and it took me six months, but I'm, they are so good. It's wonderful. They take care of you, whatever you need. So you actually utilized our in-house oh, rehab, yes. which yes. is something that we have on site. Yes. Um, again, if you need more information, please visit the rest of our videos at stillwatersenioreliving.com.